first thing people walk up to me and say all the time on the road is you're that guy that eats the pizza nacho chili dog deep fried chicken wing sandwich. In the sizzling world of celebrity chefs, few have risen to the level of fame and flair as Guy Fieri. Known for his signature spiky hair, vibrant personality and unabashed love for all things culinary, Fieri has become a household name synonymous with food, fun and flavour. However, beyond the glitz and glamour of his television shows and restaurants lies a story that's as complex as the dishes he cooks. From facing financial setbacks to enduring personal tragedies, Fieri's life has been marked by a series of challenges that have shaped him into the man he is today. So, let's discover the hidden truth behind the tragic life of Guy Fieri. Guy Fieri, you know what I need? I need you riding shotgun! I'm on my way to Flavortown! This is Donner's! And Guy Ramsey Fieri was born on January the 22nd, 1968 in Columbus, Ohio. He's a prominent American restaurateur, author, and Emmy Award winning television presenter. He gained widespread recognition for hosting various television series on the Food Network and co-owning several restaurants, though some have closed since their opening. Fieri's interest in food and cooking began during his high school years in Ferndale, California. He financed a trip to France to study by selling pretzels from his awesome pretzel cart and working in restaurants. After graduating from the University of Nevada, Las Vegas with a Bachelor of Science in Hotel Management in 1990, he ventured into the restaurant industry, managing establishments such as Parker's Lighthouse in Long Beach, California and Louise's Trattoria in Southern California. In 1996, Fieri and business partner Steve Gruber opened their first restaurant Johnny Garlic's in Santa Rosa, California. This was followed by additional locations, including Tex Wasabi's, which offered a unique fusion of barbecue and sushi. Fieri's ventures expanded further, with the opening of Guy's American Kitchen and Bar in New York City in 2012, which garnered both praise and criticism. Beyond his restaurant ventures, Fieri has made a significant impact on television. After winning the second season of The Next Food Network Star in 2006, he launched his own cooking show, Guy's Big Bite, and later gained immense popularity with diners, drive-ins and dives, where he travels across the country to showcase local eateries. Fieri has also hosted various other shows, including Guy's Grocery Games and Guy's Family Road Trip. In addition to his culinary and television career, Fieri has been involved in advertising campaigns for companies like Flowmaster and TGI Friday. He's also participated in charitable initiatives such as raising funds for unemployed restaurant workers during the pandemic. Throughout his life, Fieri has faced many tragedies and controversies. These events have tested his resilience and character, contributing to the multifaceted public image he holds today. The biggest one was the loss of his beloved sister in February of 2011. She was his only sibling and her name was Morgan Fieri. She passed away from metastatic melanoma at the age of 38. This tragedy deeply impacted Fieri, who had a close bond with his sister throughout their lives. Their childhood was marked by significant challenges, including Morgan's first battle with cancer at the age of four, which coincided with a near-fatal horse accident that Guy experienced when he was eight. These early experiences of adversity likely forged a strong bond between the siblings as they supported each other through difficult times. After her initial recovery, Morgan enjoyed years of good health, and it seemed that she had overcome the odds. However, the cancer returned in adulthood, leading to her untimely passing. Following her death, Guy and his wife took on the responsibility of raising Morgan's son Jules, who was just 11 years old at the time. This transition brought about significant changes for Fieri and his family as they adjusted to their new roles and responsibilities. Despite the profound loss of his sister, Fieri remained dedicated to his family and continued to pursue his career in the culinary world. Over the years, Jules grew up under Fieri's care, eventually graduating from California State University San Marcos and entering the music business. In honor of his sister's memory, Fieri has openly expressed his love and remembrance for her on social media, including a heartfelt tribute on her birthday. Morgan's passing undoubtedly left a void in Fieri's life, but his commitment to honoring her memory and supporting his nephew reflects his resilience and enduring love for his family. 
Again, the same year, in 2011, just a few years after the launch of his iconic show, Diners, Drive-Ins and Dives, Fieri found himself embroiled in a lawsuit with the show's producer, David Page. Page sued the Food Network after they attempted to replace him, alleging that Fieri was complicit in sabotaging his position on the show. The network countersued, claiming that Page had created a toxic work environment and failed to meet professional standards. Despite the legal battle, Vieri continued as the show's host after Page was removed as the producer. Following this lawsuit, Vieri faced further controversy when Page accused him of making homophobic and anti-Semitic comments during the production of the show. However, Vieri's publicist refuted these claims. In the same year, Fieri experienced personal turmoil when his sister Morgan passed away from metastatic melanoma. This loss was compounded by a series of professional and personal challenges, including the theft of his $200,000 Lamborghini Gallardo, which was recovered a year later in a storage facility along with other stolen items. Fieri's public image was further complicated by a feud with celebrity chef Anthony Bourdain, who frequently criticized Fieri and his culinary style. This feud escalated with public jabs and insults, adding to the challenges Fieri faced in maintaining his reputation in the culinary world. In addition to these controversies, Fieri faced legal disputes related to his business ventures, including the closure of his Johnny Garlic's restaurant chain and a failed attempt to open a wine tasting room near his home and vineyard in Santa Rosa, California. These challenges highlighted the complexities of managing a successful restaurant empire and navigating the intricacies of the hospitality industry. Amidst these difficulties, Fieri also dealt with personal hardships, including his father's battle with pancreatic cancer in 2018. Fieri's family history with cancer has made him a vocal advocate for cancer awareness and research, emphasizing the strength and resilience of his parents in the face of adversity. In 2022, Guy Fieri's downtown Flavortown restaurant in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee faced legal trouble when employees filed a lawsuit alleging violations of the Fair Labor Standards Act. The lawsuit claimed that the restaurant's owners required employees who earned tips to perform non-tip tasks such as cleaning, maintenance and food preparation without providing them with additional compensation beyond their tips. As a result, the employees argue that they should have been paid at least minimum wage for the time spent on these non-tip duties. The lawsuit sought back pay for the employees' non-tip work and aimed to prompt changes in the restaurant's pay and responsibilities policies. This legal action added to the challenges faced by Fieri's restaurant, including previous issues with health inspections and legal disputes, highlighting the complexities of managing a large-scale restaurant empire. Now, despite these struggles, Fieri has used his platform to advocate for positive change. He's become involved in charitable work, particularly supporting organizations combating childhood hunger and cancer research. His experiences have also fueled his passion for life and his dedication to bringing joy and comfort through food. Guy Fieri's primary residences are in Santa Rosa, California where he lives with his wife Lori and their children, as well as in West Palm Beach, Florida, where they recently acquired a second home. With these two bases, Fieri has the flexibility to balance his professional commitments and personal life. His professional engagements involve a diverse range of activities. As a host on the Food Network, he films shows like Diners, Drive-Ins and Dives and Guy's Grocery Games, which may require him to travel across the United States for filming. Additionally, Fieri is involved in managing his restaurants, such as Guy's Burger Joint and Chicken Guy, which are located in various states, including California and Florida. This means he could be making appearances at these establishments or overseeing their operations. Fieri's schedule also includes attending special events like food festivals and charity functions, where he engages with fans and supports causes he cares about. Throughout his career, Guy Fieri has become a household name in the culinary world. Known for his energetic personality, love for food, and dedication to showcasing diverse cuisines, his impact extends beyond television as he's established a successful restaurant empire and remains actively involved in various charitable endeavors. Fieri's legacy is characterized by his passion for food, his commitment to celebrating local eateries, and his influence on popularizing American comfort food. 
As he continues to inspire audiences with his culinary adventures, Guy Fieri's legacy is sure to endure as a symbol of culinary exploration and appreciation.